Good afternoon and a happy new year. Happy new year. Yeah. This is 2021, the year to be stress-free. Indeed. Let us face it, folks. The cause, ultimately, of all illness is stress. Now, we've known this for over 100 years. Sir William Oster, the father of American medicine, gave lectures on this in 1908. Let me just make a brief announcement for all the uh, all the folks and viewers and callers. We're going to take a, a little time. We're going to talk about a topic of stress for 2021 for a few minutes, and then we'll take phone calls after that. But we want to make sure to express the entire concept of how to be stress-free for 2021. And that's a big topic, but please continue. Yeah. So we know that stress is physical, chemical, emotional, and spiritual. Now, chemically, of course, we have fluoride in the water, and that's a great stress. We have glyphosate in our rain and in, in a lot of food. We have all kinds of other chemical stress. We have a lot more radiation than we had before 1945. But the greatest stress is personal mental attitude. Yes. Attitude, positive or negative, running the negative thoughts over and over again. Every thought is a prayer. Thinking sets in motion spiritual forces to bring about change in body, mind, emotion, everything. And so the habits that you have, the thinking that you have, are what really create your entire life. They determine how well you live, how long you live, how healthy you live, and how good you feel. In other words, an, another expression I should say is every thought is, is a, a prayer. Hmm. And so are you praying good or are you praying illness? Yes. Basically, if you're praying. Now, for instance, you know, I don't want to concentrate for any length of time on what happened in Washington, D.C. today. But that's stupid. Hmm. It is beyond stupid. It's dangerous hmm. to your life and the lives of other people to, to, to do destructive things. I can't change the weather out here. And I'm not going to waste my time thinking about it. I can't change Washington. If I can't change it in a legal simple way, I'm not going to think about it. Now, so from day one of your life, hopefully you felt welcomed when you came into life. Now, unfortunately, 50% of children do not. Mm -hmm. They're born out of wedlock. Yes. And in addition, even though they may have been born in a, into a happy home, 50% of marriages still wind up in divorce. And that means that at least one or two children in those families wind up feeling not wanted. My experience uh, with seeing clients and patients, and we've seen a lot of patients, is yeah. a lot of folks have bad things happening from the time of childhood, and that's when it starts. Exactly. That's uh... so. If you had something bad happen, fine. But what are you going to do about it? Mm -hmm. Can you change it? Well, you can change your attitude. You can change your behavior. Now, at the top of my list in changing your behavior is biogenics. That's right. Starting with autogenic training, the very first of 68 different recorded exercises in our biogenic series. If everyone would just practice autogenic training twice a day, for a minimum of three months, that would probably cure 60 to 70% of illnesses. I want to jump in on this. Um, autogenic training, it's not just a new age uh, you know, concept. Uh, well, although new age is wonderful it's to some degree, but uh, I just want to say there's, this is a scientific, uh, absolutely backed up by science, 28,000 references behind it, applicable to basically, well, it's a... It's, it's a it's a self-regulation. What it is, is uh, it's beyond uh, meditation. It's actually self-regulation, and it's by a feedback. Exactly. Yeah. In fact, Elma Green, a great friend and mentor of mine, started off creating temperature biofeedback in the late 60s. Mm -hmm. And he called it autogenic feedback training because it was based upon autogenic training. That's the foundation. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. Now, other than that then you need to start thinking about your attitude towards eating. Back before 
1950, before there was a McDonald's, we had fair foods. Mm -hmm. Not great, but fair. Now, fortunately, I was raised on a farm. So we always grew up with fruits and vegetables and fresh meats that were raised on our own farm. But when McDonald's came in, suddenly people went crazy and they went and started eating. So now 45% of all the food consumed in this country comes from, from McDonald's and its clones, the fast food restaurants. Mm -hmm. Now, personally, of course, I went to McDonald's in 1962 when it opened. I took one bite and my mouth said, this is junk. I spit it out and I've never been back. So if everybody just stopped eating McDonald's, that would improve the diet of this country by almost 50%. And the, one of the most yeah. stupidest concepts in the universe, pop or soda or oh, yeah. sugary type well, well, yeah. poison, really. Uh, well, um, Doc, Dr. Pepper used to be, they advertised 10, 2, and 4. You were supposed to drink it three times a day. Mm. And that's pure junk. There's not a, yes. no, nothing useful. Coke's no better. Pop, no, no, there's no pop useful mm. or helpful. But there's something even worse. That is in the grocery stores, there's cereal. Once upon a time, cereal was, you know, like Quaker Oats and a few things like that. There's not a single company in this country that makes a box cereal that is anything but junk. So let's talk about options. Options. Eggs. No wheat. All wheat is now poison. It has loaded with Roundup. Why poison your body with it? No sugar. There's nothing useful about sugar. It's not a food. No white rice. White rice is just as bad as sugar. It has no value. And, of course, regular Irish potatoes might be okay if you boil them only, mm. but when you French fry them, they're no longer useful food. Now, a sweet potato is better. Interestingly, sweet potatoes, of course, again, if you fried them, they wouldn't be, but sweet potatoes are actually a decent food. Mm. Now, other than that, unlimited fruits and vegetables, mm -hmm. if you can get reasonably fresh ones. And not just because of the fruits and veggies as a calorie or, or, or fiber, but because of the pH, what it does within the body milieu. Um, well, the antioxidants. Yes. The two, the most important thing other than calories is antioxidants. And I just want to mention, uh, last time we had dinner together, and we, I, I love those, <laughs> I, I, I love sitting and talking with you about all kinds of stuff when we do that. But uh, you did something absolutely amazing. You, you created, uh, and this is, a, this is a very, this is what I call fast food. It's available, it's ready, uh, some protein, lots of Oryx, uh, great tasting, uh, nutritious, and wonderful. Well, and it actually is less expensive than buying fresh vegetables. Mm. You can get your antioxidants in a dried powder form. And, you know, a little can of them that will feed you for a month gives you the equivalent of six servings of fresh fruits and vegetables in a scoop. So now let's, uh, I, I just I really want to uh, talk about, uh, since we're talking stress, stress is physical, mental, emotional, and physical. Besides, and uh, we only have an hour, so I just like to kind of, you know, just uh, get to the laser point on, uh, on some of the essentials for 2021, because this is our first show in 2021. So let's hit it, you know, let, let, let's do this right. Uh, lifestyle, and I'll mention this briefly, and we'll have a lifestyle section, lifestyle talk uh, specifically dedicated in 2021. But other than um, nutrition, exercise, sleep, veggies, uh, stress management, body mass index. The next best important thing, essential thing is stress management and self-regulation. So let's talk about biogenics. Well, you know, is it okay to say, I don't feel good or I don't like that? No, it's not. Make the decision, can I do anything about it? If mm -hmm. you can, fine. Are you willing to spend your life energy to do it? If not, detach. My favorite word for the last 45 years of my life is, if I can't change it, detach. Now, I'm not going to waste my time on it. Perfect. And I want to I, I uh, talk a little bit about detachment because I just understood very recently what you mean about detachment. It's not indifference. Oh, of course not. It's not, uh, it's, it's not apathy. It's becoming aware 
of whatever the situation is and choosing whether you need to do something about it or not. And if you can, do whatever you can. Do everything in your power. But if you can't or you don't want to or you're not, uh, for whatever reason, you've done everything you could, let go. Common sense says detach. Yes. Let go. Let it go. Now, that means at the top of your list is sleep, exercise, eat, and of course, about all of those, think properly. Exactly. Basics. The essentials. Basic essentials. Now, so let's finish with eating. There are many, many people who praise themselves and brag about being vegans. Well, you know, I can't find any evidence that veganism is the healthiest lifestyle. I find no evidence that eating healthy raised meat is harmful to anybody. I do know that vegans wind up with deficiencies. Mm -hmm. And one of the deficiencies that they have is there's no taurine, the most important relaxation amino acid in the world is taurine and there's no taurine in any plant they don't mm. make it it needs to be supplemented now guess how i got my taurine last night mm -hmm. last night my slush was a can of clams oh nice with my scoop of antioxidants or like rich greens that's what i call nutritious and delicious <laughs> that's one well it was really and it's loaded with taurine the reason i mentioned that yeah. is Clams have more taurine than any other food. Wonderful. But if you don't get enough, you can always take taurine as an amino acid supplement because it does help the nervous system quiet down. It works like a Siamese twin with magnesium. Wonderful. The other common deficiency in our American diet. We have been deficient in magnesium for at least the last 45 years. And I'm going to say Dr. Shealy, magnesium lotion is the, well, that's the only proven it, research shown. It, uh, well, it, it's 100% better. Better. And it actually also raises something called DHEA, dehydroepiandrogenase. And the original anti-stress hormone is my favorite, DHEA. Yes. And there are four natural ways of raising your DHEA. Well, there are actually quite a few. There are four simple that we all developed. One of those is magnesium lotion. One of those is natural progesterone cream, which most people after the age of 45 or 50 need. One of those is Dr. Sheely's youth formula. Now that's a fitchy one. I learned about MSM back, well, 25 years ago, maybe. And I thought, that's interesting. It, it's so important. So I gave 10 people MSM. Half of them raised their DHEA and half didn't. Hmm. Well, the people who raised their DHEA were already taking vitamin C. So vitamin C does not raise your DHEA. By itself. MSM does not raise DHEA by itself. Together. But when you put them together, it raises your DHEA a whopping 60%. So... Dr. Sheely's youth from is one of those. And of course, perhaps my favorite of all of these, Fire Bliss. Yes. Fire Bliss raises your DHEA 60%. So you take these four, they raise it not only 240%, but 250%. They work synergistically. Wonderful. And by the way, there's a package for DHEA restoration for men and women. And that's found on the website, realholisticdoc.com. So, uh, but I do want to focus uh, a, bit, a bit more on biogenics. And the program that we uh, and the course that we have out there. Well, yes, training the brain. Training the brain. Uh, that's I don't I don't think of anything. I can't think of anything more important than regulating yourself and training your brain for twenty twenty one. No, can you? And well, training it to be stress free. Stress free. And of course, so we 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 focus on diet. We focus on sleep next. It has been demonstrated unequivocally that there are more automobile accidents created by people who slept less than seven hours than by drugs and alcohol combined. Mm -hmm. So if you don't get at least seven or eight hours sleep every day, you're not only harming yourself, you're harming other people. Uh, by the way, uh, personal story. Uh, this wrist 
was not a wrist at some point. It was completely annihilated. I had to put it back in place. I didn't have a pulse after I crashed the vehicle about 75 miles an hour. Lack of sleep. Uh, personal example. Yeah. And so, and then there's one other one. Mm. Physical activity. People who sit all day mm -hmm. have the same risk as someone who smokes two packs of cigarettes a day. Yes. It only shortens your life by 12 years, but it may make you ill for another 12 to 50 years. Wonderful. So how do you go about changing somebody's choices of lifestyle? This is where the mind comes in. Yes. Now, if you look at the biogenics list, it's 68 different words, combinations. And so you start with autogenic training or basic shoots. That's the foundation. And so look at what you want to do. It, it could give you an attitude, but I have a feeling that the next most important for a majority of people is forgiveness and blessings. Tolerance, forgiveness, and blessing. Exactly. That is so missing in our society. Interestingly, some years ago, there was a, a Springfield year-long discussion of values for Springfield. Mm -hmm. And guess what would not be allowed on the word? Mm -hmm tolerance oh we found that springfield is one of the most intolerant places in the world in accepting variety of thinking it's okay to have a variety of thinking but to be intolerant of somebody because they think different of you is to me stupid at best hmm. and harmful as well well be open to whatever yeah. works that's uh, by the way that, that's the holistic approach be open to whatever works so Tolerance, of course, forgiveness, blessing, tolerance. Forgive the blank, blank, blanks of your life. It's, and it's so much fun. Who cares? It's their problem, not mine. Wonderful. Actually, speaking of, so speaking of, how do you go about self-regulation? How do you go about resetting the entire brain bucket, so, or so to speak, and the entire central and autonomic nervous system? Three aspects: physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual. And of course, spiritual is recognizing mm -hmm. that you have a body, you have a mind, you have emotion, but you're much more than that. You are a soul. Yes. And the soul is our real self. The physical body is just this physical thing. The mind is just this part of the body, but the soul is where you communicate with God and reality. Perfect. Now, I had a fortunate, but maybe a fortune, but maybe, well, I wouldn't wish this fortune on everyone uh, of uh, having a near death out of body experience with that accident that I mentioned and floating up around becoming aware of the bloody mess of a body down below with a car that was about to explode uh, and saying, how interesting. Wait a second. That's Sergey down there. Oh, that's not good. Uh, <laughs> Unfortunately, someone came and just was able to help me open the car door, which was jammed. But uh, anyway, that was fantastic. But uh, you know, we are uh, you know we are a so we are a soul being with thoughts, feelings, and emotions. So when a person says, "How do I change my, my how do I change my habits? How do I change my 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 behavior, my patterns?" You start with the fact that you are a soul being, and then you you have, but you're not limited by your thoughts, feelings, emotions, and your physical aspect. In other words, by your feedback and becoming aware of and feeding back, creating the right patterns. That's what the biogenics course is all about. And I am so glad that we took your entire work from back from 1970s and we actually put it together in a, this amazing compilation. And uh, for anyone interested, there's a link for for biogenics. If you interested in self-regulation, making your life better, more effective, more efficient, getting what you want out of life this year. This is the this is one of the ways to go. It's not the only way to go, but it's a very good way to go. Well, it's an essential if you don't do something different. There are other ways of training your brain. Mm -hmm. There's nothing as comprehensive as biogenics. And uh, a, a few other things, by the way, I just wanted to mention. Um, now, there's also supplements ah. in addition to that. And the important yeah. thing is because of the pollution of the world, mm -hmm. the Roundup and the fluoride and all the other junk that's in the world, we need approximately 10 times as much B-complex as we did 40 years ago. So I'm going to ask you a question, but I already know the answer. What's your opinion of, of the RDA recommendations for, uh, for most supplements out there? 
Well, about what my thinking is of most FDA junk. Not you, you might you're wasting your time to take the FDA. not enough drop in the drop exactly. in the bucket. Yeah. And so you need 25 milligrams minimum of B1, B2, B3, B6, and other. I prefer things. 50, of course. I prefer 50 milligrams. Well, uh, 50 is fine. 100 is safe. Yep. And for the brain, 100 it may be optimal for yeah. many people, especially since that the number one problem with B deficiency is brain trouble. Mm -hmm. Second to that is adequate vitamin C. The FDA's recommendation is 100 milligrams. Oh, God. Yeah. My recommendation is 2,000 milligrams, but with MSM and youth formula. And that raises DHEA, which is the anti-stress hormone, and exactly. it doubles the effectiveness of vitamin C. And, of course, vitamin D3, with your FDA recommending 400 units. Mm. And to me, if you weigh under 140 pounds, you need at minimum, a minimum of 5,000 a day. If you weigh over 140,000, you need seven to 10,000 a day. And there's a much easier way to do that by 50, taking- 50,000 once a week if you weigh over 140 pounds, 50,000 every 10 days if you let weigh under 140 pounds. And by the way, all of this can be found at realholisticduck.com. That's the website, realholisticduck.com. And if we have our support people, we can actually put some links up for those who are interested. But uh, go ahead. And one other, mm -hmm. vitamin A. Mm. Once upon a time, vitamin A was from cod liver oil. Mm -hmm. And that's okay. But actually, too much of cod liver oil and vitamin A can damage your brain. Mm. And so astaxanthine, A-S-T-A-X-A-N-T-H-I-N, a minimum of 10 milligrams a day and up to 30 milligrams a day is excellent for your brain and your skin. Wonderful. I'm going to mention one more thing, which is essential for stress. Three things, actually, and we can cover that maybe perhaps after the break if we have time. And I'm just going to say that out loud. Taurine, lithium orotate, and tryptophan. Well, and tryptophan, well, you just gave us making serotonin, the bright-eyed, bushy-tailed wake-up hormone. Exactly, exactly, yeah. My favorite. Now, folks, you make the choice. I can't do it for you. I can tell you what to do. I can suggest what you do. But you have to make the decision. Do you want to be healthy? Do you want to be happy? Do you want to live healthily and long? Well, then behave. Detach from those things you cannot change. Attach yourself to stress-free. 2021. And we continue live, but uh, right. yeah, uh, actually, I'm going to take my headphones off for until the break is over. So uh, for the uh, for the Facebook live and um, and the YouTube live uh, audience, uh, I'm just going to continue the conversation. Uh, stress free life in 2021. 2020 has nearly destroyed well let's talk about the research that we've had we've we've done recently and that was a fascinating research well with a with a for with, years we have wor worked on regenerating telomeres that tip through dna mm -hmm. they are responsible for how healthy you are and how long you want to live and how well you live mm -hmm. we found a technique which unequivocally regrew or regenerated your telomeres in six months eight percent that's swapping yes that was before the stupidemic we started another group just about the time the stupidemic began in that group the telomeres shrank in everybody everybody it turns out it was due to stress and if this continues, the situation continues to uh, to remain a situation, guess what? We need to have, everybody out there needs to have good stress management techniques. Absolutely. It's essential. You've got it's, to detach from the crud that's going on. It's not even an option. You have to have it if you're going to survive. Yeah. Interestingly, yeah. we're redoing the test now, but we're adding some things to decrease stress. Mm -hmm. In addition to what we already do, we've added two major stress reduction approaches to see if we can get back to where we belong. And perhaps when we get back on the radio, let's talk about some of those options, if we have opportunity, yeah. of course. Of course. And 
then I also want to talk about the attitude of your mind in general. Perfect. To be at peace most of the time. Now, we began with looking at scalar energy several years ago. Mm -hmm. the, the idea being that scalar energy focused is the most powerful energy known. According to quantum physicists, all this empty space throughout the universe in something tinier than the tip of my fingernail there, <laughs> there's enough energy to boil the world's oceans. And Nikola Tesla was one of the originating founders of and that kind of a concept. It reduces oxidation of your cells, the free radicals, by a whopping 40% just by sitting in front of you for an hour a day. An hour a day reduces your free radicals by 40%. Imagine what doing it all day does. Well, that's what I do. Yeah. I have one in my home. I have one in the office. One in your bedroom. One in the bedroom. Well, that's so right. do I. Yeah. And now today we did the first real EEG with resting versus having the scalar near the head, mm -hmm. not in the room, just right near the head. It is the most striking EEG I've ever seen. I saw. That was amazing. I mean, bright red. Alpha, theta, and delta, mm. all of the relaxation modes of the brain. And that makes a lot of sense because, uh, again, the concept behind scalar is, well, it's uh, and actually, it's a perfect companion to the PEMF, wouldn't it be? Exactly. Right. So let's talk a little bit about PEMF and scalar combined. Well, PEMF, pulsed electromagnetic frequency, is actually my favorite other than scalar. Yes. <laughs> because it actually we now this is one week beyond three years of treating 10 chronic narcotic addicts mm. three full years people who've been addicts for 25 or six years mm -hmm. every one of them is still free of addiction and craving and one woman actually who had been an addict for 20 years just had a baby and it was healthy because she was two plus years out of her narcotic addiction before she got pregnant. Wonderful. Wonderful. And every one yeah. of them now is free of prison and back in normal society again because of the use of the PEMF an hour or two a day. And if you use it even more than that, well? Well, it's okay to use it 24 hours a day. Yes. Unless you've got a pacemaker. That's the only contraindication. Mm -hmm. It's about 30 seconds till we're back in. Now, what's oh. interesting is, as far as I can tell, I'm going to go ahead and ask it. This woman, I believe, used it while she was pregnant, but I don't recommend that. Well, you know, in general, you know, and this con this is a concept of, uh, you know, just any anything in medicine, pregnancy is one of those things that uh, you just have to be careful. That's all. Um, okay, and we're almost back to radio. Best driving is drunk driving. A message brought to you by NHTSA and the Ad Council. Now, back to Wellness Wednesday with Dr. Norm Sheely and Dr. Sergey Soren. And we're back again. And now I just want to mention the, the, the lines are open. Just give us a call. If you want to ask a question, make a comment about anything, because it's all related to your health. And at the top of the list of the things I love to talk about is acupuncture. In the mid-50s, I suddenly had an idea that if we put a needle in and hooked an electrical stimulator to it, it would improve acupuncture. I introduced the concept of electroacupuncture. But regular acupuncture still has many, many benefits. And if you want to consider acupuncture in general, well, there's one person and only one, Dr. Jill, right here in Springfield. The Wellness Concepts Clinic, 1200 East Woodhurst Drive, Suite R300. 417-877-1300. Wellness Concept Clinic, Dr. Jill, the acupuncturist of the millennium. And of course, every day is a day when you need your health food supplements, but we'll take this call first. Good afternoon. You're on the air. Good afternoon, gentlemen. Happy New Year to you. Thank Happy you. New Year. <laughs> I'm getting crossover sounds like on the phone here. I don't know why that is, but... Um, can you uh, perhaps turn the radio off uh, as an echo? Or? Well, I'm calling you. Let's see if I can. 
let's see. I'm not sure. <laughs> it's okay. We can hear you. No worries. I can okay. hear you. Yep. Okay. Um, I've called up. Uh, my wife had a question and asked me to call up for you. If there's a new strain of COVID coming out, would you suggest anything different? No, I still feel the top of my list is vitamin D3, the okay. youth, youth formula, uh, and uh, B complex are our uh, essentials. In other words, support okay. your immune system just like in any other situation. Okay. Uh, I had two other things, but I, I think I'll try to call you back in a minute or two so we'll have this crossover and ask and just make two other comments here, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. I'll let talk to you in a little bit then. Thanks for calling. Yeah. Actually, Thank hold you. on. There's a few more. Um, comments or questions there on that uh, on that question yeah. i think uh, uh go ahead please uh yep hello oh, do you want me to? okay oh uh i'm sorry I, did i uh, understand correctly or okay yeah i can hear by repeating the background i'll call i'll call you right back in a few minutes then so we'll okay. have this cross thank you okay? thank you mm -hmm. and of course spring valley natural foods the source in springfield where you get service as well as product Mm -hmm. Right there on South Glenstone, you walk in, you don't have to, they've got thousands of goodies, so you don't have to go looking for them. They come out and help you find them. And they carry a wide variety, more than most other places even know exist. Spring Valley Natural Foods, the greatest health food store I know personally, greatest I've ever been in, is where I shop and you should too. And of course, if you are an average American, you could almost get enough additional adequate nutrients, antioxidants, by adding just nature blessed tart cherry juice concentrate. Two tablespoons a day gives you 3,750 ORAC units. Mm -hmm. That's equivalent to almost four servings of optimal vegetables. So, since the average American gets only 2.2, you add nature blessed tart cherry juice and you've got something good. In the produce department at real grocery stores. And good afternoon. You're on the air. Good afternoon once again. This is Odell from Utah. I just talked with you a couple of minutes ago. I thought I'd clear this up. I, I just wanted to make a couple of comments that in case your listeners weren't aware of this, and you probably are, but just in case. Mm -hmm. I'd heard this recently on the news on the Internet that Elon Musk, or one of the two things, Elon Musk, the uh, auto manufacturer, the Tesla automobile, one of the richest men in the country, mm -hmm. said he took four COVID-19 tests in one day, two of which were positive, and I think another place in two of which were negative. Mm -hmm. So that he says, you know, how unreliable those tests are. Mm -hmm. and, yes. And I'd, al I'd also heard, too, that, uh, and, and also read that hospitals put down the case of death being COVID-19 sometimes, and they get several thousands of dollars more like anywhere from $10,000 to over $70,000 if the hospital reports enough deaths over a specific period of time. And I'm thinking, that sounds criminal to me, but... Uh, well said. You know, Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I just thought I'd let your, your uh, uh, listeners know that. And uh, uh, once again, when I call in, I, I see something happen. When I don't call in, I don't get this to can make sure this is posted so... Uh, my family members can go back and, and listen to this if possible because it's whenever I brought it up to you and called in, it appears. But if I don't, seem like I can't find it on the either the station or your uh, Facebook page. So, yes, and there are certain. I'm, I'm sorry. Yes, you're. Uh, uh, thank you for saying that. And now, because we yeah. are on uh, Facebook Live, we are. You know, we again, we we have to be careful in terms of some some things that we say or don't say. Uh, <laughs> otherwise, you know, not, none of this information will ever get through. But uh, you know, so we you know again, just reading between let the let lines me, there. Yes. Let me just say, a quick. Where are you? <laughs> I'm I'm in uh, 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 Eagle Mountain, Utah. Ah, okay. I thought you might be from New York. The way you speak, you speak so fast. I can't talk as oh, fast uh, as you do. <laughs> well, this is Missouri, so hey. <laughs> yeah. Well, I used to live back in Springfield, and all the kids live out here. So I'm a uh, youthful seventy-three. So we're out here with uh, four kids and ten grandkids. And so here we are. Keep the faith, babe. <laughs> and I'm just gonna say yeah. this out there: just a simple statement. The truth is out there. If you want to know, yeah. you can. You you will find it. That's exactly right. Blessings. All right, gentlemen. I'll, I'll let you go. You have a happy new year. Yes. And the same to you. Thanks for calling. Okay. Uh, and uh, again, just without saying anything overly uh, well interesting, so to speak, uh, in the eyes of uh, certain people, the uh, I'm just gonna say: focus on your immune system. Don't worry about a lot of the. You know, again, if things don't make sense, it's because they don't make sense. That's just it. Uh, focus on your immune system. 
Yeah, you can't make sense out of nonsense. Thank you. <laughs> or uncommon, uncommon, uncommon stupidity. By the way, uh, I do want to say our book, Common Sense. When is it going to be out? Have you gotten an answer yet? Oh, any day now, any day. Any day. Any uh, that's day. what I hear. Yes. Restore common sense. We've been working on it for almost two years. Yes. And if you if you have a question about the book, please put a comment, put your name down, and we'll send you the information as soon as it becomes available. And of course, we have another one that'll be coming out hopefully later this year called Will of the Soul. And I'm excited about that. That's wonderful. But the most important thing is Will of the Now. Yes. Here and, and now. Ca case of yourself right now. Mm -hmm. Now, good afternoon. You are on the air. Hello. Yes. Hi. Hi. This is Gail, and I have a um, question for Dr. Sheely. This is he. Great. Thanks for this show. I've um, been hearing a lot of um, information come across about brain supplements, and there was one, um, if I could mention the name, uh, Pro Mind Complex. Uh, bromine complex. Pro P R O P R O M I N D. Promine. Yeah, I don't. I don't know the name. Do you know what's in it? Yeah, I mean, there's. I know I couldn't repeat what's in it either. Even though you know, on this info email, they gave all that sort of thing. And you've mentioned different things already this afternoon. I was wondering if we could go over a list um, to feed the brain. Of, of course. Supplement. Yeah, the optimal brain is, of course. A multivitamin, my favorite, of course, is Dr. Sheely's Essentials. Beyond that, it would be vitamin D3. How much do you weigh? 115. Then you need 50,000 units of vitamin D3 the 1st, 10th, and 20th of every month. Okay. Third would be astaxanthin, A-S-T-A-X-A-N-T-H-I-N, 10 milligrams. Uh, Could you spell that again? A S T A X A N T H I N, 10 milligrams daily. Now, those are the vitamins themselves. Now, if you need relaxation or if you feel as if you just are too tense, you need two other things for certain that is, magnesium lotion. I do use that. Great. And you may need taurine, the amino acid, T-A-U-R-I-N-E. It is great for relaxing the brain, it is wonderful for hypertension, and it can help you sleep, among other things. I'm going to throw in a few others. Uh, NAC and acetyl uh, L-carnitine. If two. you are missing energy, if, you, with, if you're already doing everything else, but you just don't have the energy, in fact, just this morning, I did what I often do with a patient. When I'm, I gave her an envelope with three capsules each, one of NAC, 600 milligrams, and one of acetyl o carnitine 500 milligrams. I say, take one in the morning and one at noon for two days. If that doesn't make you feel great, the third day, take both of them in the morning mm -hmm. and decide whether that gives you any, because NAC and acetyl L-carnitine are two natural substances that can give you wonderful energy all day. The other thing that really works well for energy, but also for the brain, is nitro extreme. Nitro, N-I-T-R-O, X-T-R-E-M-E. -E. Yes, it helps you make nitric oxide. And the key to energy in your cells is nitric oxide. If you need information of that, go to our website, and up at the top, you'll find a link that takes you to Kayani, K-Y-A-N-I. And the website is, just for those who are, well, it's, it'll be uh, hopefully on the, uh, on the streaming YouTube Live, Facebook Live, but www.realholisticdoc.com, real, holistic with an H, D-O-C, doc.com. And there's actually a lot more information there to begin with. Now, by the way, Speaking of stress management and relaxation, orogenic training is available at no charge. It's right. Everybody can get basic orogenic training, basic shoots, mm -hmm. just for signing up for our free email newsletter. Orogenic focus. You get it at no charge. If you don't want the newsletter, you can unsubscribe immediately after you download the, the orogenic training. Although I think you want the newsletter. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you so much for the question. Thank you. 
Thank you for your information and your your zest for life. Thank you. Blessings. Have a good one. Thank you. And good afternoon. You're on the air. Oh, great. Um, my brother has chronic low hemoglobin. He's real ill right now. But uh, it's been for like three years. He fell and had a subdural hematoma a couple of weeks ago. Had to have that evacuated. When he went in, it was ten, and when he came out, it was seven point one. His hemoglobin, and they're like, "Ah, uh, we don't really transfuse anymore." Well, and they he, never give him a reason why it why he has this. Well, have they checked his iron level? I'm sure they have. Yeah, they have him on. I think they call it poly iron twice a day. But it doesn't seem to be doing anything. I thought I'd check with you and see ah. what we should be doing or Thank you. what Thank I should ask mm -hmm. PCP. Or I'm going to say something. Uh, this, is, this brings up a very important point. When, uh, when the conventional system fails to give answers, you need to step out. You need to look at, uh, at our options and alternatives. If you have a low hemoglobin level or, in other words, anemia, Anemia without a good explanation and just supplementation with iron sulfate, as mentioned, which is, you know, it's fine, it helps, but question is, it, and this is the root cause question, why is this happening? So this is where it becomes very important to get a holistic, not a superficial surface, but a holistic evaluation. And well, if you yeah, have, a, have they checked his bone marrow, for instance? That's right. To me, yeah. I mean, they, they, they haven't. Yeah, well, then they, they, they need to find out why he's not making blood. And that's the first question, because then you can start to do something about it. So okay. I would I would find a different physician personally. And uh, we can yeah. also, if you like, we can also assist. We do telephone consultations. Well, we we do, can't do. We can we can suggest it. We can. But we can't do the bone marrow aspiration. But also, sometimes people with chronic disease or uh, or, or or regular or overwhelming stress can also have anemia of chronic disease. But well, again, of course, you know, the first is we need to know his high sensitivity CRP. Mm -hmm. Uh, an infl okay. inflammatory marker. We need to all know all kinds of things to know why yeah, he's not. He has AFib, diabetes, oh, he's, disease. Okay, he's he's deficient in magnesium. And he, yeah. Oh, yeah. see, it's on the magnesium lotion. He's he, very he, high. He, yeah, he, he's and got he's a bathe in it almost. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm sorry, he's got what? Well, I said he almost needs to bathe it. I'm teasing. Um mm -hmm. The magnesium lotion, but is part uh, of this. this is well, this that, is, that's a very complex situation. Mm. It he, really is. He needs a, co a comprehensive. Well, he needs a comprehensive holistic physician. Where is he? He's here in Springfield. Oh, well, we are available. Okay, so I because I thought I told him I said you know you guys he's been messing with his doctors and he's a single man so you know he doesn't really pursue. He just says what the doctor says and nothing, and even minimally that. Okay, well, I think I'll talk to him about coming to see you guys because he's getting no, he's getting worse. Yeah, call 351-5221, call 351-5221. Wonderful. All right, I'll do it. God bless you. Thank you so much. Hey, thanks for calling. Have a good one. Thank you. Yeah. I do want to say something on this topic. And one of the reasons why we exist, why the holistic medicine exists is because I just want to say that, that one of my favorite expressions, the Einstein's concept or definition of insanity, doing the same thing and expecting a different result. It just doesn't work. So if you're dealing with a healthcare system that's failing you, guess what? You got to do something different. And we are different. And, uh, well, uh, and holistic is the alternative. Yes. Integrative may or may not be, but in Springfield, integrative means nonsense. For, for for the most part, yes. That's, uh, being, that's being kind. Yes. Okay, uh, so folks, you have the option, and right now we still have just a very few, we've almost filled up our latest research project. So if you want to get in to rejuvenate at no cost, a safe procedure for regenerating your telomeres, call three five one five two one and set it up right away. And good afternoon. You're on the air. Hello. Yes, I have. A, I yes. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Um, I have a question. Um, I've started losing more hair than normal, and my hair my hair has uh, used to be kind of medium structure, and now it's very fine. Mm. And my my nails are very brittle. 
and my skin is dry. And I bet your temperature is low. That's right. I'll give you, uh, I bet your oral I temperature is below 98.6. I think I have checked it a couple of times and it was. You are hypothyroid. Mm -hmm. Well, they put me on, uh, let me hear, oh, I wrote it down here this second. Uh, where'd I put it? Levothyroxine? Uh, yes. Okay. They well, put me on that mm. three years ago. It's mediocre. And I consider levothyroxine typical medicine. It rarely works well. Fails about 50% of the time in my experience. Yeah. yeah. You need to be uh, converted. What? You need a minimum to be converted to Armour's thyroid. Mm -hmm. now, speaking of Armour thyroid, uh, and it's a much better medicine, plus, you know, a, 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 a proper evaluation would be certainly advisable on top of all that. But uh, people who are not right. getting good results with levothyroxine and now, a lot of. Let me ask, the, I presume you drink city water. Uh, uh, say that again. I'm you, having trouble. Do you drink? Hearing. Do you drink city water? Yes. Well, that's poison. Stop it yesterday. Well, I'm sure it is. It, what What else do you drink? Get yourself a <laughs> Kangen, K-A-N-G-E-N, filter, and don't ever, ever, ever drink or cook with city water again. It is pure poison. Fluoride. That's e the trouble. Wait, wait, will you spell that for me one more time? K K A N. Oh. G E N. Okay. It's filter. a lot better than bottled water. Yeah, I don't drink bottled water because I know most of it isn't fit to drink. Exactly. Well, it's and, all, most of it's made out of city water. Mm hmm. Okay. Um, I will do that. I've been thinking of coming in and having a, I think an that, evaluation. Yeah, I think <laughs> that the time has come. Three, five, one, five, two, two, one. We'd love to work with you. Five two two one. Okay, three, thank you three, so much. Three five one five two two one. Yeah, thank you. Oh, okay, thank you. And folks, again, let me just finish this business about telomeres. We've got only we've got we're two thirds full this week. We've only got a third of the small study open. If you want to get into the telomere rejuvenation study, you've got to be fifty to ninety years of age and taking no prescription drugs. And Call 351-5221 because we are going to fill up next week, almost certainly. And, of course, detach. Back to the most important thing you could do. Is it going to help you any to, to run to Washington and have a riot? Or run to Kansas City or Jefferson City or any place else and have a riot? No. Why bother? It doesn't, it doesn't work. It's not safe, but... It, First of all, it really isn't the final answer to anything. If you can't change it, just detach. Now, if someone's coming at you with a gun, well, you, you can fight back if you like. But basically, I'm not going to fight things I can't change. And this is back to the concept of stress management, self-regulation, and... Stress-free 2021. That's it. Folks, you are responsible. We can talk here all day, 24 hours a day, but we can't do anything for you unless you make a change yourself. I can't eat for you, think for you, exercise for you, sleep for you, or make any other change for you. I can suggest changes, but I can't do it for you. And that's the number one problem that people have is not making that decision to take responsibility and act upon it. So let's just give a quick summary of the big major concepts, just a big overview. So first of all, you got to have the foundation of lifestyle. That's essential. Number two, you, you, you should be able to control your mind, thoughts, feelings, and emotions and stress. Uh, and that's uh, one of the most comprehensive, the, the, the comprehensive system that I know about is the biogenics, which is a course. Of course it is. And uh, uh, go ahead. And well, yeah. you know, next to me is making these changes and you, systematically make changes in your nutrition, in your activity, in your sleep. These are the biggies. And in your thinking, you start with the biogenics, but you start with supplements and then you make the other changes that you need. And if that, if you need more than that, then you probably need the gamma P E M F and the adrenal medulla scalar device yes i think 
those two can change your brain and mind safely, healthily, better than anything else I know anywhere in the world. And this is the home of holistic medicine. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, continue. Uh, go ahead, please. Uh, you were. Um, no, go ahead. Yeah. You know, I just wanted to jump in with a few other thoughts uh, for anyone out there who feels lost, who feels powerless, who feels discouraged, uh, and a lot of people are. And again, I'm not going to go into detail. You, you, we, we, we know what where we are. We know what's happening. Again, just because we don't say everything, every detail, you know, that it's out there. You know, just because the world is full of nonsense out <laughs> there doesn't mean it has to come into your life. You ha you do have control about you. You, you can filter what you take in what you allow and how you live your life regardless of anything outside and one other thing and i do want to close it i do want to say this at least once freedom freedom uh, cannot be taken away it can be given away it can be forsaken it can be thrown away but it cannot be taken away so hold on to your freedom if that's what you value if that's what you uh, if that's important to you hold on to your right to be a human being hold on to your capacity to live your best life regardless of what's happening outside and think positively yes think well my favorite statement of all look in the mirror and say i'm okay because god does not create joke and then change anything that you feel isn't right for you Change what you can, let go of what you can't, and be at peace. And detach from those other things. Now, one more time. Go to R-E-A-L-H-O-L-I-S-T-I-C-D-O-C dot com. Sign up for our free Autodidic training. Autodidic Focus right there at no charge. Download it. Do it twice a day. It is the beginning of transforming your life now and for the rest of your life. And happy, amazing 2021. Uh, 2020 was interesting. Let's make 21 better. Every thought is a prayer. Think positively. Be at peace. And as far as the radio, we are officially done, but we can still close up with a few other thoughts or suggestions or anything off the top of your head? Dr. Shealy. Well, be at peace. To me, there's nothing more important than being at peace. I cannot imagine joining, joining any rally, which is a riot. Well, and I'll, I'll, I'll say this. Uh, there are personal choices out there. I'm not going to say what is right. I'm not going to say what is wrong. But do, you know, for anyone out there, do the best you can. Do the right thing. I just want to say, it, do the right thing. And uh, once you're done, be at peace. Love and uh, blessings for 2021. And uh, we are on for, we'll see, we'll see you again next Wednesday. Take care.